fine welcome back to my channel if you're a returning subscriber thank you for your time thank you for the support i appreciate much god bless you if you're new here you are welcome please before you leave this channel remember to subscribe and when you subscribe click the notification bell so that you'll be the first one to be notified whenever i upload juicy videos <laughs> Yes, guys, I always upload juicy videos. So in order for you to be notified first, <laughs> click that notification bell. So dear friends, today's video is inspired by my fellow YouTuber, my sister, <laughs> a Tanzanian lady based in Germany. Her channel name is called Mama Franjo Vlogs. Please check her out because she does videos about workouts, interracial dating advising people who are looking for white men for marriage she does videos also about germany life in general so guys last time there is a video i watched on her channel you know we support each other we youtubers so this video there is a lady who was asking for an advice this lady was online dating apps and she was chatting with a man from uk and this man was very weird they chatted and she did not understand this man at all in the end the guy blocked her that is when she decided to look for an advice from mama franjo vlogs so when i watched her video or when i watched and that is when something pushed me to do this video of today which is the types of white men online to be careful about because that lady was chatting with a white man very very dangerous guys but she did not understand so I can't just say be careful guys when you are online dating apps without telling you the types of dangerous white men to be careful about so our video of today will be the types of white men you should be careful about when you are online dating apps so friends I understand if it is your first time joining online dating apps everything is new you don't know anything how to go about these online dating apps and it is also very exciting because when you join you start getting a lot of messages from these white men you get a lot of attention from these white men but remember all those messages that you get when you join online dating apps it doesn't mean that all men really want something serious with you some of them are there to just play games some of them if you decide to give them your heart your feelings your time in the end you will regret no so guys without wasting much of your time let us jump into our today's video right away to know these types of white men you should be careful about when you're online dating apps <laughs> type number one of the white men you should be careful about when you're online dating apps these types of white men that i'm going to be sharing with you today it's all about the conversation that you have with these white men online because <laughs> it all starts with a conversation so type number one are those white men that tells you i am looking for an obedient and submissive woman <laughs> guys to some of you especially african ladies it might sound okay because we were told to be submissive and obedient to our partners <laughs> <laughs> yes guys and if you ask me Bella are you submissive to your partner <laughs> and obedient I'll tell you I respect my husband and he respects me back <laughs> so these white men will tell you I'm looking for a submissive and obedient woman when you hear that guys don't think it's okay it's not okay it's not it's not because First of all, it's a red sign of a controlling partner. And there is nothing as bad as being in a relationship with a controlling partner. This man will make your life very difficult. Your life won't be easy. He's going to control everything. Every move that you do, he's going to control your life in general. 
and not only that guys if he is telling you that online right now it means that your whole relationship or the whole process of getting to know each other he is going to be controlling you and you must do it because he told you from the start that he is looking for a submissive and obedient woman so if he tells you please send me your nude photos you're going to send them because <laughs> you're obedient <laughs> and submissive you don't want to make this man angry because <laughs> you not being submissive or obedient it means that he is gonna be angry at you so guys this is a red sign of a controlling partner it's not okay. don't think it's okay because you were told to be obedient and submissive to your partner it's not okay at all it means that I am going to control you it means that I'm going to look down on you it means that whatever you do I am the boss yeah that is what it means guys so be very careful of this type second guys to me as Bella if a man tells me I want someone who is obedient and submissive it's so offensive to me because you can't tell me to do something i am an adult so you should watch my character if you like it or not <laughs> and you should take time to know me if i am respectful or i am not respectful it takes time to know someone so you can't just start telling me i want you to be submissive i want you to be obedient because that's how i like my woman it means you are not my man so if you're someone who doesn't like a man who will look down on you if you're someone who doesn't like a man who will control your life a man who will be the boss <laughs> of your life then this man is not for you be careful about him when you're online dating apps and the sign is those words when he starts telling you he wants someone who is submissive and obedient type number two of the white men you should be very careful about i know some of you will be like bella it's not like that <laughs> yes guys and it's something very very tricky it's so tricky guys the types of white men who sends you money in an exchange of something else some of them might tell you and some of them might not tell you they will tell you that I'm sending you money because I love you so much I want you to stay very comfortable I don't want you to stress so that is why I am sending you money but guys be very very careful because there is something i've been noticing most ladies receive money from these white men but in the end the same white men that have been sending them money <laughs> block them the same white men that have been sending them money disappear on them <laughs> yeah i've been noticing this and i think these white men send you money to blind your eyes yes guys but you don't know it he sends you money because he wants to waste your time for you to stay quiet and sweet he will keep on sending you money and this type of a man who sends you money so that you can keep quiet and stay sweet takes you as his property <laughs> you shouldn't see any other men you shouldn't chat with any other men online <laughs> you should respect and be obedient to him whatever he tells you you should do it because he sends you his money 
that is why I'm telling you he takes you as his property you are my property I'm sending you money because you are mine you should stay there wait for me so he will do everything that he wants to do with you and when he is done with you then he is going to block you he is going to just disappear on you completely then you'll be like but he was sending me money the guy was real he loved me guys this man was just taking you as his property so be very careful of these white men that do that and other white men that sends money also they sometimes send you money and want something for an exchange <laughs> I remember one time I was helping a lady online she told me that she was dating a guy online and then this guy started sending her money without asking and then this white man one time sent money to her and then this girl was like thank you so much I really appreciate for you sending me money and then this man was like is it all then the girl was like, yes, thank you so much. I'm, I'm very happy and I'm very blessed to have you. The guy was like, I am very disappointed in you. Is that all? Is that how you thank me? <laughs> Meaning he wanted something else because when they continued chatting, the guy wanted nude photos as an exchange of the money. So be careful of these white men that sends you money and meeting a guy online then this guy starts sending you money doesn't mean he is serious no guys no 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 i have a very long long list of ladies that have been dumped after these men have been sending them money so be very careful don't be used don't be used for 100 euros don't be used for 50 euros don't be used for 200 euros because you might be doing things without knowing that this man is just tricking you by using his money be very careful guys be very careful i insist and if this man truly truly loves you he will save this money that he is sending you for the ticket for the visa process yes guys guys it's so so wrong to ask men money these men you meet online the truth is they will run eventually yes guys i am assuring you eventually they are going to run I repeat guys a serious man will save that money for the ticket and the visa not sending you money every month every month every month and then there is nothing as the future he's not talking anything about the future but he is sending you money but if it is only money that you're looking for online keep on receiving and give them what they want as an exchange but i am telling you it is so wrong stop it stop asking men money online because it won't take you anywhere if a man is sending you money without asking don't take it as he is serious don't get blinded and forget to see the red flags don't get blinded guys don't get blinded i think i should stop here on this <laughs> Type number three of the white man or of the white men you should be careful about online. This one is very connected to the video I watched from Mama Franjo vlogs. You meet a guy online and then this guy starts telling you that he wants a lady who will treat him like a slave. Guys, this one does not exist it does not exist if a guy tells you like this run because he is sick in the mind and it's so sad that on online dating apps exist 
a lot a lot of crazy people with sick mind I'm not trying to scare you but I am telling you to be very careful because yes things can go further you can go ahead and date this guy but remember he told you from the start that he wants someone who will treat him as a slave <laughs> so he is going to practice weird weird things on you and because I told you online dating apps exist crazy people with crazy mind be ready for crazy eggs <laughs> Be ready for a man to tell you, tie me and start beating me because it makes him happy. Be ready for a man to tell you, I'm going to invite two or three friends of mine and then we make love. Be ready for this man to tell you that I want you to sleep with other guys when I am watching you because it makes me happy, you know? Because <laughs> I want you to treat me like a slave. Be ready for a man to start telling you, strangle me <laughs> when you're making love because this is what crazy people do. People with sick mind do. <laughs> Don't tell me, Bella, have you ever experienced that? I've never experienced that but I've been seeing these things happening from other ladies so please please if a guy tells you I want you to treat me like a slave don't take it very lightly it is something very serious and two bad guys is that people who have sick mind they are also good at manipulating so he might manipulate you and then you fall into a trap that will make your life very miserable so stay away from this crazy person even if you want a white man even if you are desperate please please just don't chat with this guy or don't date this guy Type number four of a white man or of the white man you should be very careful about when you're online dating apps <laughs> are those white men who always talk about SEM. All the time you chat, he talks about that. He utters a lot of vulgar language, language which is very offensive to you when you chat with such kind of a white man online end the relationship immediately if it is possible block the guy because he is just there to play this reminds me of a lady i was helping i think five months have passed this lady was chatting with a guy a white guy online and this white guy was very offensive guys in his texts the only thing I could see was vulgar vulgar language in all the texts that he could send to this girl because she sent me the, the screenshot of their messages but <laughs> this girl didn't come to me because of those vulgar languages no she came to me because the guy had blocked her and she was so sad that why did this guy block me he was so good he was so sweet but when she sent me the screenshots of their messages it was all about as this guy was telling this girl that i imagine to do <laughs> to your goodies but guys it was written like the way it is the way this guy wrote this it was written the way it is like i want to be over i hope you understand <laughs> yeah he was very very offensive i got angry <laughs> if this girl is here watching she can remember i got angry because this girl down on the message 
that this guy was sending her those crazy messages she was laughing like ha, 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 please stop and she told me the guy was so sweet that is why men play us online we entertain them how can you entertain such kind of a thing how can you entertain such kind of language you shouldn't entertain that please please my dear beautiful ladies because it's not good at all that man is not looking for what you're looking for which i imagine is true love so it's better to stop it or just make him understand that please i don't like this language you are not for me just disappear and even before you tell him disappear if you show him that you are not happy with his language he is going to block you first <laughs> i'm so sure <laughs> be very careful with a white man who uses a lot of vulgar languages on you because that is not respect and a lady should be respected type number five of the white men you should be careful about online this one most ladies won't realize it <laughs> until you go through it so you find yourself chatting with a guy at first he sent you very beautiful messages you got excited and you thought maybe he is serious then you start to be the one fighting for this relationship <laughs> so it's you who sends him messages it's you who calls him but if you don't do it then he does not call you back or he can just send you one message today and then comes back after three or four days my dear beautiful ladies you are going to lose your energy <laughs> This guy is not looking for a serious relationship. Yes, guys, you are only losing your energy for nothing. <laughs> a guy who is looking for true love, who really want to be serious on a relationship, he will put some energy into it. But if a guy is just, you know, <laughs> like lazy in your relationship, he does not want to put any efforts into it but it's you who puts a lot of efforts <laughs> he is not for you so be careful of this type so if you chat with a guy you exchange some few messages he is very excited chatting with you you exchange phone numbers and then when you come to chat it's like the energy has reduced <laughs> from 100 to 30 <laughs> percent dear sister this man does not look for love he was just playing you know <laughs> like i told you crazy people exist online so you say how would someone be excited and write me beautiful messages then then the energy just goes away yes they exist all types <laughs> all types of crazy people so this one is crazy too so i don't know why someone should waste his time and the time of the girl but they still do it so if someone isn't putting a lot of efforts isn't excited as the way he started the relationship just don't waste your time you will lose your energy you will lose your time and remember <laughs> we put a lot of our emotions <laughs> in these relationships so it's so so bad when you put a lot of energy into something but you don't get anything out of it so it's better to be very careful chat with someone who is always excited for your relationship excited to get to know you <laughs> type number six of the white men you should be very careful about when you're online dating apps <laughs> are those white men who had relationships in the past so they have their exes <laughs> like you have and then talks very bad of the ex 
very very bad guys when you ask about the ex hmm nothing good will come out of him he will be talking very very badly offensively about the ex and women in general like someone is very angry at women if you feel something like that it's not a good sign at all it does not mean this man is going to love you it does not mean that this man is a good man because I know no matter what happens in a relationship everyone has got their own path so if so if a relationship goes bad it means he contributed and she contributed for the relationship to go bad so if this man is talking very very offensively about it means that the guy is very aggressive a guy is disrespectful a guy is inhuman because no matter what happens we should always respect each other i've had a lot of breakups in the past i have my exes but i still respect them as human beings because they are human beings they deserve to be respected so a man who cannot respect his ex who talks very offensively about his ex a man who talks very badly about women in general like he hates women don't expect to be loved don't think you are the queen <laughs> one a million mm -mm. <laughs> it's not like that guys it's not like that this man isn't good be very careful if a man cannot respect his ex talks bad about his ex offensive words talks bad about women like he hates women he takes women as an object dear beautiful sister this man is not good and if you could get a chance to talk to the ex you could discover more bad things about him <laughs> so don't think you are the queen one in a million mm -mm. if he can't be respectful he will never treat you good number seven i've talked of this before but i am repeating because most ladies especially those who really really want a white man so bad they fall into this trap you are chatting with a guy online and the guy tells you i am married i am still married but i'm in the process of leaving my wife dear sister don't waste your time don't 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 because he will never leave his wife he will never he, he will chat with you you will attach yourself emotionally to him and in the end he will tell you you know what i couldn't leave my wife because we have kids together i couldn't leave my wife because we have a lot of properties together if i leave her it means that i will lose my property i will be poor so i cannot leave my wife i'm so sorry and all that but you have invested a lot in that relationship which turned out to be a bitter one <laughs> never date a guy online who tells you i am still married i'm planning to leave my wife because your relationship will never work out so guys that's the end i have a lot a lot a lot of more types but if i tell them all or if i share with you all it means this video won't end and i want it to end so that you can relax and watch my other videos which you have not watched so thank you so much for watching this video till now i really appreciate it much 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 god bless you please give it a thumbs up if you've liked this video share it with your friends family everyone that you think will enjoy this video and learn something comment below what you think about this video watch my other videos too like i said subscribe please join the family <laughs> i love you so much guys you are always here in my heart. Let us meet in my next video. <laughs> ciao, ciao.